I am honored to address you today as we face a difficult period in our nation's history. As we all know, corruption and economic crisis have taken their toll on our beloved country, and it's easy to feel like giving up. But I'm here to tell you that giving up is not an option. In fact, it's the very thing we must not do if we want to overcome these challenges. We have a rich history of resilience and strength as a people. We've weathered many storms before, and we'll weather this one too. It won't be easy, but nothing worthwhile ever is. We must not let these challenges define us. Instead, we must rise up and face them head on. First and foremost, we need to come together as a community. We need to support one another, and we need to hold those in power accountable for their actions. We can't change the past, but we can work together to create a better future for ourselves and for generations to come. Secondly, we need to focus on what we can control. There are many things outside of our control, but there are also many things that we can do to make a difference. We can choose to educate ourselves on the issues facing our country. We can choose to be proactive in our communities. We can choose to be responsible citizens who pay our taxes and follow the laws. These may seem like small actions, but they can have a big impact when we all come together. Finally, we need to believe in ourselves and our ability to make a difference. We have a wealth of talent and creativity in our country and we can use these talents to build a better future. It may not happen overnight, but if we stay committed and work together, we can create a brighter tomorrow. So, my fellow Papua New Guineans, let us not give up in the face of adversity. Let us rise up and face these challenges together. Let us be the change we want to see in our country. We can do this, and we will do this. Hey.